Hey there, first grade, how's everybody doing today? It's Mr. Andy back with you for some more math learning and understanding. So today we are gonna start lesson 1.1 in math right after I shrink myself into the corner. Today we are gonna be doing grade one, lesson 1.1, introducing first grade everyday mathematics and we are going to start with a warm-up let's count together from zero to ten so i have a little bunny on the screen my bunny is going to be hopping as he hops we are going to count all the way up to the number 10. And you're gonna wanna try really hard to stay with Mr. Enzi. It's almost like the beat to a song. Here we go. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Awesome job. This time we're going to go backwards. We're going to count back. We're going to start at 10 and go all the way to zero. It's like a countdown of a rocket ship getting ready to blast off. Let's start. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, Zero! Awesome job! Let's try it again. We're going to count up. Zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And finally, we're going to count back, starting at ten. Here we go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. And I bet some of you yelled blast off. Awesome job. Today in math, we are going to learn this really fancy word. This word is subitize. Can you say that word with Mr. Enzi? Subitize. Subitize means to be able to instantly see how many there are in a small group. I want to show you what I mean. In math class, we often use dice. Well, mathematicians, those who are really good at math, like me and you, we don't have to count the dots. We can subitize the pattern. For instance, just by looking at this very first die, I know there's only one dot. I didn't have to count the dots. I saw that there was one, and in my mind, I know it means one. And then we come to the next dice. The die here has two dots. I can just look at it and know it has two. I don't have to count it. Now, first graders might have to count the dots to make sure they know. But pretty soon, you're going to be able to subitize those dots. And then the number three, one, two, three dots. But when I look at it, I automatically know it's three. Four dots, five dots, six dots. So we're going to try a little activity where I'm going to show you some quick look cards. And they're quick look cards because you're not going to see them for very long. So you have to pay attention. Here we go. You're going to see a card and it's going to have some dots on it. I want you to try and remember how many dots you see. Here's my first card. How many dots do you see?
Notice the card flipped over. It's now hiding it from us. How many dots did you see? Hopefully you said one. Let's check. One it is. It's the easiest side of a die to subitize. Let's try another. Get ready. How many dots do you see? This time, there were two dots. One, two. Awesome job. Let's try another. How many dots that time? This one was a little bit harder, wasn't it? One, two, three dots. Let's try another. How many that time? This time there were one, two, three, four. Four dots. Let's try another. Hopefully you saw five dots. Here's my four on the outside and one in the middle. One, two, three, four, five. Our last one. How many dots did you see that time? That's right. One, two, three, four, five, six dots. Let's try it again. This time, it's going to be in a different order. Let's see if we can do it. Oh. My cards have been shuffled. How many dots did you see? Did you guess five? One, two, three, four, five. How many dots did you see? One, two, three, four, five, six. That one wasn't too hard. One, two dots. That time there were one, two, three, four dots. One, two, three, and our last one. I think that's the easiest to subitize. There was only one dot. Awesome job, first grade. So today we learned the word subitize and how we're going to learn those dice patterns and have them in our minds so that we don't even have to count all the dots. We can just look real quick and know how many there are. You're going to be heading into Seesaw and you're going to do an activity that's going to involve some dice and some dots. Have a great day. We'll see everybody real soon.